Hello everyone, this is Ed from Great Hudson Sailing. I'm on board the new Oceanus 40.1. Right now I'm standing on the swim platform. It's an electric swim platform. There's your ladder to come up from the water. There's a really nice mid-step here. It makes it very easy to get up on the cockpit floor. Once you're up on the cockpit, at the helm stations, we have these uh, seats, which actually lift up. Get out of the way if you want to stand while you're at the helm. Twin rudder, twin wheel. Relatively large cockpit. There's no stumbling over anything in here. Easy to maneuver around the boat. It is raining a bit, so I'm just gonna walk forward and come back on the boat so you can get to see how easy it is to get around the boat. So right here, this is about a 10 to 12 inch step up. And now you're on the catwalk. Walking forward. Forward, we have a really nice uh, pulpit here. There's your windlass, anchor locker. This boat is set up roller furling main, code zero uh, furling screecher here. Looking aft on the boat, you can see how the, the lines run nice and neat. So a nice little setup on this boat is how, if you're looking at the mast, you see how the lines are all running towards the cockpit to those um, coach top winches, but the winches are very close to the companionway. So what that allows is a lot more space up underneath the Dodger. Let's walk aft. Here I am back in the hel in the uh, cockpit. This is the starboard helm station. You have wheel, your B&G electronics, anchor, uh, anchor counter, bow thruster, there's your throttle. You see jib your jib sheet lands right at the helm station. Very easy to come about. Just move this cushion out of the way here. So here's that area that I mentioned. This boat has been sailing all day, so I apologize. So you have a little flat area there. You could probably prop yourself up gives you an additional little seat okay here we are going down into the cabin of the 40.1 set T to port dining area chart table really nice setup here is the c-shaped galley and what it affords us is a huge open areas so it's very easy to get from the companionway to the forward berth Galley has a refrigerator, oven, stove, microwave, double sink. Going forward. Now, traditionally, you don't see a bed where you can mount from both sides, an island type bed, until you get to the 45 range. So this is great to have it on this size boat. You can step in the cabin. It's much larger than the 41.1. You have hanging lockers on starboard and port. This boat has the wash up setup. So there's a small sink here. This boat can be set up for an additional head. So if you look above that channel, will form the walls for the bed and then the bed i mean the bath rather and it will come pretty much to that door so it takes a a good chunk of the open space in the room but it is an option for the second head this boat is set up as a two cabin boat so we can't put a generator in here. This is kind of like what they call the butler's pantry. That is access from the lazarette on the port side in the cockpit. 
So it's a huge storage area, but it can be a cabin if you choose to make it a three cabin boat. Starboard cabin. It's an ensuite, so you have a door that takes you into the head. Head with a separate shower with glass doors. Any question on the boat, just shoot me an email, ed at greathudsonsailing.com.